<laughs> I'm so excited, baby. I have got a really good feeling about this one, okay? Just do everything like we practiced, all right? Oh, and um, that picture that we took last week, did you add that to the, the lookbook? Yep, got it right here. All right, um, you, you are gonna do great, okay? Uh, just be you, okay? Oh, and, and uh, call me when it's over, all right? I love you. Love you, bye. Did you hear the casting director is also casting the new campaign for Kaylee Cosmetics? Seriously? Mm -hmm. That would be so major to land a job like that. Right. Excuse me, did I just hear you say Kaylee Cosmetics is looking for models? Yeah, um, but it's a makeup campaign, so there would probably be no interest. What are you talking about? I love makeup. Mm, read the subtext. They wouldn't be interested in someone like you. What do you mean, they wouldn't be interested in someone like me? Well, modeling is about showcasing a product, right? And the model's job is to blend into the background, which would be kind of difficult for you to do because the eye would get distracted. It's like modeling 101. Didn't your agent tell you that? I don't have an agent. I have a manager, though. Who? My mom. She's actually the one who encouraged me to pursue modeling for real instead of just on social media. She helped me create my lookbook and everything. Honey, no one is going to take you seriously if your mom is your manager. I work for the Kardashians. Look at Kendall Jenner. She's one of the world's highest paid models. Have you ever booked a professional gig? Not yet. I've gotten one or two small sponsorships on Instagram, though. That's the problem nowadays. Everyone thinks that they can be a model just because they get a few thousand likes on Instagram. How many followers do you even have? Uh, hold on, let me check. Almost 2,000. 2,000? <laughs> I think I had that many in middle school. <laughs> do you Photoshop your photos? No. Well, I FaceTune. I hide my vitiligo behind foundation and concealer all the time. Well, why wouldn't you do that before coming in today, then? Because my mom's always encouraging me to embrace who I am more. So I thought I'd give it a try. Honey, I'm gonna give you some advice. If you want to be a professional model and book professional gigs, you need to cover up with makeup. This is why you need more than your mom as your manager, okay? How'd you even hear about this casting call? I saw an ad online. <laughs> you responded to an open call, how cute. Open calls are a joke. They won't even look at you if you don't have an agent. Wendy Thomas? Good luck. Lookbook. <sighs> Name. Wendy Thomas. Agency. None. I hate open calls. All right, let's see. Your skin. Yeah, it's been this way since I was a kid. It's... If it's a problem, we can cover with makeup. I hide it behind foundation and concealer all the time. Cover it. It's perfect. Really? I've been searching for a girl like you all day. <laughs> the photographer is going to lose it once he sees you. I'm going to book you. I need you on set first thing tomorrow. Alex, can we give her the details? Oh my gosh. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I cannot believe this is happening. I've been on so many casting calls, but this is the first one I've actually booked. I'm thinking her with Diana and Genevieve. Can we make that happen? Good. I won't let you down, I swear. 
May I go call my mom? Yes, yes. You just show up tomorrow exactly as you are. You got it. You got it. Did you hear Stefan Ananda is the photographer? No way. Doesn't he shoot for Vogue and all the top brands? Mm -hmm. After you girls are done getting ready, go ahead and change. Diana, I have you in the Dior for the first look. Genevieve, you're in this Halston. And Wendy, you'll be wearing this. <coughs> um, can you give me a second? Oh. Mm -hmm. Um, is there some sort of a mistake? I thought I'd be wearing something more like that. Nope. This is what they asked for. I just take orders. If you want, you can talk to the photographer. Would you mind taking that to him? Uh, sure. Come on, hurry up. Stefan. Stefan. Mm hmm? She wanted to speak with you. Excuse me. Hi. Um, I'm Wendy. I'm one of your models. Hi. You are the model with the interesting skin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that would be me. I was so excited when Joe showed me your photo. Oh, you are going to be so great in this shoot. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Mm -hmm. Um, could, is it possible that I wear something else? Uh, why? I, I, I picked out... All the outfits myself. <laughs> yeah, the other dresses are amazing, but mine is so hideous compared to everyone. Yeah? You chose this on purpose? Of course. But why? Did nobody tell you? Tell me what? The concept of it. OK, the concept of this shoot. All right, we have these two beautiful swans, yes? And they are surrounding an ugly duckling. <clears throat> and you are the duckling. What? Yeah, when I pitched this idea to the client, they absolutely loved it. Very fashion forward, very chic, they said. And then we found you, and it was sort of like, it was sort of like fate. Like it could not have worked up more beautifully. <laughs> so you only book me because you think I'm ugly? Are you upset? Why are you upset? This is a great opportunity for someone who looks like you. What do you mean someone who looks like me? Listen, <clears throat> honey, no one else is gonna hire you, okay? You should be grateful. There are millions of other girls out there who would kill to be in your position right now. I'm not one of them. Where are you going? What are you doing? I'm calling an Uber and leaving. No, no, no. No, no, no. You cannot do that. You signed a contract. You got a check. You're right. I did. You can have your money. I'll keep my dignity. Do you know how much a shit like this costs? Thousands of dollars. Thousands of dollars will be down the drain if you leave right now. You know what? I work for a lot of brands. I will make sure that you never work in the, you know. Your career is finished, duckling. You two shut up. Wendy. Baby. You didn't text me, so. How'd the shoot go? I don't want to talk about it. Wendy? Baby? Baby? Wendy? When? You okay? Please, just leave me alone. Come on, Wendy. Talk to me, baby. What happened? I'm an idiot. The only reason they booked me is because they made me the ugly duckling. I was a joke to them, to everyone. Oh, sweetheart. Baby, you know that is not true. You are not a joke.
Yes, I am. I've been going on castings for months. And the one time, one time I actually book a job, it's this. I can't believe I actually thought that I could be a model. Baby, what are you talking about? Of course you can be a model. You, you can't let one bad experience keep you from doing the thing that you've always wanted to do, baby. But it's not just one bad experience, Mom. It's been rejection after rejection. The other girls were right. Models need to be able to blend in. I could never do that looking like this. Baby, that's what being a model is about. Listen to me. Do you think the world's top models merely blend into the background? Hmm? Kendall Jenner, Cara Delevingne, <laughs> Winnie Hartlow. Hmm? They only made it, Mom, because they had connections. No, baby. They made it because they embraced what makes them different. No, oh, baby, good. Being unique is what makes you beautiful. You're only saying that because you're my mom. <laughs> no. I'm saying it because you need to hear it. Welcome. If you want to quit, then that's up to you. But baby, please, for the love of everything in me, please do not quit because the industry is short-sighted. The industry is short-sighted. Even the photographer said I'd never get another oh, job. Forget that photographer, what does he know? He knows everything. He's one of the top in the industry. He shoots for Vogue, all the top designers. One bad review from him and it's over. No casting director, no agency, no photographer will ever give me a second chance. You don't need all those people. Yeah, actually I do. They're the ones who give people who look like me an opportunity. Well, why wait for them to give you an opportunity when you can create your own? You don't need a magazine to reach an audience. Your audience is right here. I hardly have any followers. <laughs> well, maybe if you stop using Facetune and wearing all that makeup, <laughs> then that'd change, baby. Who's gonna wanna see me anyways? Besides, I don't even know where to begin. Well, we'll figure it out together. As long as you stay true to yourself and embrace what makes you unique, then baby, you will always succeed. So, can we please, can we please try it? Fine. <laughs> With her mom's encouragement, Wendy decides to keep on moving forward. This time, when she creates content, rather than hiding what makes her different, she embraces what makes her unique. As time goes on, she starts to do different photo shoots. Even though her mom is the photographer, she doesn't let that discourage her. When it comes time to posting photos, at first she wants to go back to her comfort zone. But her mom reminds her of her promise and Wendy reluctantly agrees. As time goes on, Wendy's following begins to quickly grow. People love how authentic and real she is. The mom and daughter couldn't be more excited. As her followers boom, so do her sponsorships. She starts receiving packages from brands all over the world wanting to promote their products. Wendy was finally starting to live the life she always dreamed of. And then one day, she even gets to work with one of her favorite brands. Welcome to Kaylee Cosmetics. Hi. You're Wendy Thomas. Yes. 
great. Uh, have a seat and I'll be right back. All right. What are you doing here? Yeah, I thought you quit modeling that day you walked out on the shoot. Well, I have a 10 o'clock photo shoot. It's our call time. Guess they needed another ugly duckling. Wendy Thomas in the flesh. I am so excited to be working with you. We're gonna have so much fun today. You are gonna be wearing this little number. Fabulous. You two are gonna be wearing those. Wait, 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 hold on. There has to be some kind of mistake. Yeah, why are we in these? Mm. No mistake. No one told you? Wendy's the lead on this campaign. So she's top billing. What? She's not even rep by an agency. No, but she's slaying it on Instagram. What are you talking about? She only has like 2,000 followers. Actually, a lot has changed since we last saw each other. One million? How is that even possible? All these followers being the lead, I, I don't understand. What'd you do differently? Let's just say, I learned to be comfortable in the skin I'm in. A wise woman helped me realize what makes me unique is actually what makes me beautiful. Hi, Mom. Oh, hey, baby. <laughs> Love that. Shall we go? Yeah. Wendy Thomas? It's so good to see you. My daughter follows you on Instagram. I can't believe how much you've blown up. Congrats. Thank you. Hey, listen, I'm casting a few projects right now you'd be perfect for. And are you still looking for an agent? I'm sure I can get you a meeting with a friend of mine. He represents all of the top models. Thank you. But I have the best agent, manager, and mom a girl could ask for. Shall we? Yes, we shall. <laughs> so, I was thinking. Hey, wait, can we talk about our dresses? Hello? Seriously? We have a new student today. Hi, I'm Liz. It's nice to- What's up with your arm? Is that why your parents called you Liz? Because it's short for lizard? <laughs> The real life lizard. Why are you recording? I need to check out her arms. <laughs> Do not post that. Oops. I just did. 